After weeks of waiting, the city of Bozeman re-signed the Gallatin City County Health Department agreement. The reason that we signed it, rather than say no, is because, you know, there's a ticking clock. The city of Bozeman signed on to the health department contract, but did so under protest. Their reason was in response to House Bill 121 and 257 that passed last year, which shifted power away from health officials to elected officials. Our feeling is that the way this legislation was crafted was really, really sloppy and ambiguous. Gallatin County and the city of Bozeman had different interpretations regarding the duties and responsibilities. We had two different uh, legal departments looking at the same piece of legislation, arriving at different conclusions about the Board of Health's duties and responsibilities, and that was uh, the sticking point. The new state law, which passed in 2021, has caused problems stemming from different interpretations. That a separate governing body of elected officials uh, have to approve certain Board of Health decisions. The new governing body will be made up of the three Gallatin County Commissioners and the two mayors of Belgrade and Bozeman, but the city and the county agreed on separating politics and health. Damn that there's very fundamental questions about what, how, how health should be separated from politics that eroded with these new laws. Their ultimate hope is that the transition will be seamless. Our intent isn't that it actually performs or does any different work or that anything really will be that different. The new contract is set to take effect once all three governments sign on. The only one left now is the city of Belgrade. Hope that the community understands that none of the way they access any of these services or any of the oversight of any of their health regulations will really change. None of that changes. It's just the decision matrix that will happen during emergencies. Bozeman, Andrew Cedillo, MTN News.